Hello, familia. Bonso, hello. <laughs> Welcome to this new Tresena video. And we began a new Tresena today, a new 13 day period within the Mayan Cosmovisions. And we have moved into the energy of Sikin. Now, Sikin represents the bird, the sacred bird. And within the Mayan Cosmovision, this could be referred to as the Quetzal. Uh, in other traditions, the sacred bird, maybe the condor, the eagle, the colibri, hummingbird, picaflor. Those are all the hummingbird, by the way. <laughs> um, or wh whatever bird is sacred to you and your tradition that you may resonate, resonate with. Um, it could also be the guacamayo, the vulture, the bat. But this video isn't about naming all the birds in uh, the zoology. This video is about the energy of Sikin and what Sikin brings to us. So when we think about the bird, the energy of the sacred bird, we think about the vision, right? Because birds are able to take flight and get an aerial view of things. It's called bird's eye view for a reason. When you are able to zoom out and really look at the full picture. So over the next 13 days, I invite you guys to zoom out and get the full picture. Sometimes we get so wrapped up in just the minute and the littlest of details, the littlest of littlest of details, and like micromanaging everything in our lives that we forget the bigger picture and we forget why it is that we are doing what it is that we do. So over the next 13 days, come back into the heart space and remember your emotional drive, your purpose behind the vision, right? Why did you have this vision in the first place? Come back to that. And if there's anything that has created distortion, ask for clarity. You know, maybe you feel a little bit lost. You had this great vision and you kind of started executing it, or maybe you didn't, but you just were kind of just like, okay, I had this vision, but now what, right? <laughs> so ask for clarity, 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 clarity. Ask for clarity and create the space for the clarity to come through, right? If we continue with this monkey mind and constantly thinking, and once again, like I said, just stressing on the just littlest of details and we're not leaving space for the clarity to come in so allowing yourself to take a breath take a step back from what it is that you've been hyper focused on and get a bird's eye view and when you get this bird's eye view from this height right from this expansive vision then then you can hone in and zero in on the details. Um, you know, and when we look at birds of prey, when they see their prey, they don't hesitate. But sometimes they're up just hovering in the air, just floating around, waiting, being patient, really scanning the ground, scanning the area before they pinpoint see exactly what it is that they want and they go after that they're not thinking about oh well if I go after that then you know this other bird over here or you know this squirrel up in the tree no the, the bird is not worried about the squirrel the bird is going in probably maybe for the squirrel if it eats squirrels I don't know <laughs> but yeah that's what I can invite all of you guys to focus on for this tercena, right? Uh, clarity. I think that we can all use a little bit more clarity these days. Um, and it doesn't have to necessarily always be a project that you're working on. Just asking for clarity on life, things that are coming up. You know, there are many different viewpoints and lots of information coming from many different directions. So asking for clarity for yourself so that you know which direction to take. And when we have clarity, when we have a clear vision, then we can take clear and aligned action. And when we take clear and aligned action, that's when we invite prosperity into our lives. And it just floats. <laughs> so yeah, that's what I have to share about this Tresena, the Tresena Tzikin. Ask for clarity in your vision. When you have this clarity, 
take aligned actions. And then from those actions, we will call in the prosperity. Okay, I love you guys. <laughs> I hope this video was helpful. And if you have any questions, please leave it in the comment box below. Um, yeah, I look forward to sharing the next video with you all. Ciao, ciao.